Alright, alright. Now that I am back, it's not HSR today. <laughs> the the next HSR stream, maybe possibly, will be the update. Later on will be WUA. AKA maybe tomorrow I'll be doing a WUA stream. Ooh, weathering waves, yes. You can grind gold and gears. Ah, true, true, true. Yeah, I can grind for it. I haven't been doing those uh, versions on the simulated universe. Thank you for reminding me. Yeah, I can just grind those. Maybe sometime. Yes, blah, blah. <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, I'll be continuing off our lap on this game. Just so that I can finally get into the DLC and then... I mean, finish the main quest and then into the DLCs because there are two DLCs. I'm pretty sure the DLCs are not that long as well, but yeah. And I am drinking hot chocolate because I've been... <laughs> I have been recording a part for a song, so... Good thing my voice is isn't required for a high pitch, and I did it didn't take me that many takes. And then I sent everything over. So yes, I have been singing. <laughs> oh hi, Austin. Hi, how are you? Hope you're alright. Okay, without any further ado, let us bring you here and enter. All right. Checking the church was a good idea. Now I know that Alyosha is alive. I still can't call the Aurora, but at least I know they intend to rendezvous with us at the dam. There is some really bad news, though. Anna has gotten worse. I must hurry back to her. Oh god, this game really... Yeah, I, I, the reason why I want to finish this game is because how, how freaking ridiculous this is breaking. This is dying on me, ha! Ah. Hey, you're working? Let's go. Good luck at work. For Abiotic. Oh, is it on sale? I just checked. I thought it wasn't on sale right now. Yeah, I don't think it would have another big big sale unless their publisher will be doing a big sale. I mean, fair enough. It is a new game, so I, I wouldn't expect them to have any higher anything higher of a sale past 20% because it really literally just came out this year, this month, last month. Yeah. And that is typically common for anything that is new. There are some games that I do want to get, but yeah, they're very fresh. They're way too fresh right now. So I couldn't, sadly. Oh, you thought I... No, I'm not playing one human today. <laughs> Wait, what made you think that I'll be playing one human? Where's my Okay, I don't remember why is it's so slow. I'm pretty sure my mouse is way very well charged. Shouldn't be a problem. Wait. Alright. Trying to recall. But Austin, are you planning to buy it? Oh shit. If I remember closely, yeah, I just need to go down and head down to the boats. Do I have anything else? There's no point of me going down there, I think. I think. Okay, let me just check. Uh oh. 
Oh my god, freaking Steam! Why did you have this stuff? <laughs> One's fishy. Oh no no no, he he was telling that I, I'm checking on with um Yume, the other streamer, for one semen. But uh, that that game I don't think I can ever be able to stream it because it's it's a little buggy or laggy on stream. The optimization still needs a bit of work. I don't know yet. I haven't seen. To be honest, I just added it on my video since you said it. Yeah, I was interested in it. If only I can play with people. I mean, I can solo it, but uh, I'd rather play those types of games with people than rather than alone. Oh, where am I? But yeah, I mean, if you are going to be buying it, then I will as well. And then at least we can kind of quote unquote schedule some time to play together. Since I'm kind of sort of free. Oh yeah, this is mostly humans as my enemy, sorry. Okay, so this is more of like a lookout for me. Is there any particular places that I need to be? What is that? I feel like I've been up there. Uh oh, this is kind of like a shortcut, huh? Uh oh. Co-op games are meant to be played with friends. Yeah, that is true. Every working adult gamer is right now. I mean, I could solo it. But where's the fun in that? Yeah. It do be like that. The feels. The feels. Of being like... I mean, I can do it alone, but... But... Oh. Wait, am I lost? Did I? <laughs> how do I? How do I get back? Oh no, there it is. Okay, I can swing on the other side just to just to check what's up. Maybe there's something else on the other side that I can pick up al along the way, aka resources. But yeah, I mean, if you are going to be buying it, then yes. So that we can schedule. Can I get that? Free mushroom. What happened to you, sir? Ooh, yeesh. Uh, since I use my healing, goodness me, by accident, because Steam decided to pop up on my screen and lag me to crack out. Look at that. Pixels, diamonds. Where am I? Uh oh. oh, I'm down here. A boat. Just a boat. Oops. Oh god, come on. Ah, been a while. Okay. Maybe find more peeps? Yeah, sure. If we can find more peeps, like at least two more people, because from uh, I don't know how many, what is the max of people, but y you know, usually co op games are up to four people. If we can find two more, 
that can play with us with that game that'll be great Is there anything that nothing? I don't need to unalive anyone unless I I needed to. Wait, is that a boat? <sighs> Caution. There's a way into the place that I don't think I need to. Let's run over here. Preferably we can we find them during the sale period of the game. True, that is true. Is that some? Okay, going through there wouldn't be viable. Ooh, can I go down? Can I get down? I have to be sneaky in this game, holy hell. I mean, I can essentially go out loud, but where's the fun in that? Okay, I'll curl maybe down here. Then I'll go around. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, wait. I thought that was a body of a person. <laughs> Never mind, it's a shrimp. Okay, they. Oh, they died people here. Can I go through here? I. Never mind, I cannot go there. Oh well. Uh, <laughs> how am I? I'm okay! I definitely did not just squeak right now. But how are you? How are you? <laughs> God damn it. I don't have, I have to worry about humans, and then I'm going to be worrying about shrimps. Perfect. God damn it. <laughs> How is that I cannot cross up along these things? Sneak. Oh. Is that a person? Are you... Are you guys kind enough for me to... No, no, it's not. People are gonna unalive me, not that. Oh, they're ready. They are ready, sure, sure, fine. fine. You ready? I'm ready. Let me show you how to be a freaking shot. Didn't know, baby. <laughs> uh, it's 
slightly of a scare of a game. Oh my god, the snakes, I swear. But not too much. I just get jump scared by sudden attacks by the creatures. That's the thing. That is my only problem. Alright. My god, no, don't you touch me. What did that say? I cannot read that. Resources. Great. But yeah, I hope you guys are well while you guys are working. Yes, yes, yes. Focus on the job. Unless you're telling me that you're perfectly okay on the job. Come on. Get up there. Perfect. Get up there. Can I have their gun? <laughs> I haven't been picking up the weapons of my enemies. I forgot that I can carry three weapons. No? Really? You didn't have to Wait, can I have that? Wait, wait, I just saw something. Give. <gasps> yes, finally. Uh, I have a different gun, but I don't have any. Oh, I have ammo. Oh no, why is it like this? Okay, I'm gonna pretend to fix this. Oh, please let me. Holy hell. Alright, sure. Uh, yes. Compensator, long compensator. Is that it? Oh, yeah, give. It's fine. Give me this. Perfect. My thing is okay. How many enemies are there? One, two, three, four, five. I don't need to essentially take them out, right? Or. I mean, if worse comes to worse, I have to take them all out. Can you add me on Steam? Yeah, sure. Yeah. You can add me on Steam. Hold on. Wait, are we friends on Discord? Ready or not yet? So that I can send you over on DM. Ooh. Okay, wait. I need to know exactly where I am. I can hear the enemy on my left, but... Okay. I need to know where... How many? <gasps> oh. <laughs> yes, galaxy. Sure, sure. Let me add you on Steam. <laughs> Am I being absolutely dumb? Oh no, never mind. There you go. Actually. Is that someone there? Oh, what is happening to that thing there? Okay, that dude is walking. One, two, three.
Yeah, I'm gonna add Kazuki too. Yes. I should have done this in a more <laughs> darker time than this. What do you mean I didn't hit that? My Steam ID... I mean... Wait, from what I understand, you can search people by their name, right? On Steam? Okay, hold on. Oh no! Huh? What? What do you mean? Huh? Why am I hitting them? What do you mean it's not hitting? What the fuck? Okay, they know me. I'm here anyway. I know in my left hidden. Oof. It's faster to use friend code ID. I mean, yeah. I cannot add. P I cannot just simply put my ID on on chat. That's why. Hidden. <laughs> Are you on Discord? That is why that I'm asking Are we friends on Discord yet? So that I can send over my Steam ID Yes, grenade raccoon. Hi, raccoon. How are you? <laughs> Why are you bonking me? I, I I asked you. Uh, okay. I don't think we're friends yet on Discord. Wait, too many people. Is your name the same on Discord? Mr. Austin. Or you have a different name for Discord. Because, yeah, I don't see you. So, I think not yet. Alright. Wait. Are you a member on my server? I have way too many people. <laughs> oh my god. What? Oh, I'm checking members. Holy heck. There. Hmm. So, no, not yet. You're in my can goods. Austin. Alright. I'll double check on that. No, uh reckon I, I actually can throw stuff for where's Discord? I can actually throw stuff. Austin, Austin, Austin and there we go. Oh, you do have a different name on this card. Alright. Uh, where's my Steam ID?
and I think I can only throw <laughs> what is that cans because I lost everything I lost everything for this for this map I mean that's how the game decided it to be so I'm like bruh <laughs> my resources Alright, Austin, I sent you my Steam my Steam ID and also added you on Discord. Oh god, this game. Yes, this is normal. Oh, come on. My shots aren't registering. What the heck? Can you guys surrender, please? Oh, there you go. Ooh, you think you can freaking hit me, huh? And you did. And I got you. <laughs> okay, I see the person there. Oh my god! <laughs> The freaking shortcut button to open the overlay of Steam. I'm being blocked by the thing. Is the shrimp still there? I wonder. Ah, oh, okay, I saw them. Is this a shotgun? Yes, please. Oh, it is a shotgun! What do you mean? <laughs> you blame me for what? What did I do? I thought I broke stealth in... Oh... <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah... <laughs> I forgot you're playing at the moment. Did they surrender yet? No, none of them are surrendering yet, Mugi. Sadly. Hiya. <laughs> I wish they would just surrender. You know? Did they... Did one of them say give up? Holy hell. Is this even edible? Yeah, I could have been able to get down here. 
I know an enemy is still alive, but I'm kind of like <laughs> turning into a freaking loot goblin again. The wolves at the master. <laughs> I don't know. I can find you. You're just screaming over there. I can tell that you're over on that side. Sure. I'll fight you as a human. As a marksman. Where are you? Where are thou? You're hiding in a building. Mm -hmm. Is that the last of them? No, no it's not. Did you die standing? Please surrender. My god, at least the freaking bandits know how to surrender. You guys, you guys are persistent, huh? Okay, they're way over there, so uh, they're not a problem. Ah, put a little courage. Okay. Where is your friends? I am here to loot the corpses of your friends. There you go. This is the... Yeah, it's the thing that I'm using. Eh. Did I... Change my gun? No. Wait, what is that? I'm just double checking if this is the gun that I think. Oh, it's the handgun. No. That's not what I want. Not what I want. Da, 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 da. Hold on, sir. Let me. Your death can wait. Yes, you see me. Oh. There you go. Did his body fall in the water? Okay, there we go. Is... Oh, okay, none of them surrendered. Great. <laughs> Did you DM it on Discord? Yes, I have sent it over on Discord already. Is that a postcard? No? No? It's okay. Oh, it is something. They're actually chopping up the freaking shrimp. Or I mean, they were chopping up the shrimp. It's still breathing. What are they doing to it? It's undulating. But still, focus on your work first. <laughs> Goodness me. You can check on later. 
Oh, none of them surrendered, so... Too bad. Too bad. Okay, I'm gonna circle around. Is there a body there? I think there is. Yeah. These are the pirates, I think? Ooh, knife. It's nice to meet you. And there it is. I'm gonna climb over there. Is there anything up here? Nope. Nothing at all. What about on this side? Nothing. Nothing. It's the Shita. Oh. Why we. <laughs> okay. Anything here? No? 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 I don't think so. <clears throat> What's that for me? Oh. Wait, was my flashlight- Oh, my flashlight was on! <laughs> Oh, is that how they were able to see me? Oops. My flashlight was on this whole time. Uh oh. Oh well. They didn't say anything about stealthily taking a boat, so. Get over here. That's the boat. Yeah. Is there anything you can get here? Yes. Resources. I need a lot of them. Oh my god. The game is breaking my frames. As usual. Alright. Mm. Oh, a note. Okay, I need light. Is that a poster? Poster, poster, poster. <sighs> Press the um, check. Confirm. There you go. You, sir, are confirmed to be my friend now. <laughs> oh. Oh, perfect. Sorry. I found the control area. Let me sweep up around here first before I do anything else. What is it? Oh. Yeah, like that. Anything here? There's the musical instrument. I would have been able to, but not peacefully. Right. Open this thing. Mm. Oh, so that's your real name. <laughs> that's nice. Okay, I have already accepted your friend request, so you'd be good. Yar got La Boat. Now. 
I hope no shrimp is gonna bother me on this little go find a stretch. Yeah. I I'm literally running back to my wife. Okay, just have to cross over there. Okay. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merely, 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 let this bird again. Rowing mighty back to the town. In the smirky waters of the shrimps, calm and bound. Up to my head. Ooh. Uh, the Geiger is the Geiger. Geiger, Geiger. Can I drop here? <laughs> what in the world is my character doing? Here, I'm trying to stop. Oh, what what happened to you? Okay, radiation is high at the moment. Did you get eaten by the shrimp? Okay. Oh. Did I just see something huge? Okay, let me... Wait, what happened here? Why are you dead? Let me get up here first. Yep. You are the one with the cat profile. Ooh. Please don't break. Okay. Okay, I'm. I think I'm able to see things from this tree house. Okay. Moving forward. Alright. This is the murky swamp. Is that a knife that I can get? No. No. Alright. What happened here? Are the people dead? I can see the shrimps. Aka their source of food. Wait. This area is radiated. Why? Oh. That person's gone. Wait, did they get attacked? It shouldn't be. Someone was guarding the front. Okay, that's a lot of shrimps. As long as I'm in... Okay, it's just a shrimp there. Okay, where will I be landing? Okay, I'll be landing on that thing if I go down. How do I get to that? Okay, I'm able to see where I'm going here. Oh! Am I be able to get on that platform? Yeah, this platform up there, to the left, put that ladder down, and then shimmy my way around. There's nothing for me on the ground anyway. Okay, go there. And there's those explosive spores. Maybe across that? 
Where do I go? Is the question. So far, the only enemies that I faced in this area is wolves, bears, and generally mutated animals. Oops, sorry. So it shouldn't be that bad. Let's get into it. Yeah. Wait, rather than getting into it immediately. Did I say something gone? Okay, there we go, my healing. My arrows, do I need any more of that? <laughs> I forgot my freaking barrel is like this now. For the shotgun. Uh, oh, this is the ash shot. Do I want this? No, it's okay. These are freaking armored things here. Yeah. Alright. I haven't found a single safe area in a while, aka a workshop, but it's fine. Okay, radiant radiation levels seem fine. <laughs> to get over here. Ooh. Ooh. What is that? He did get hurt. Excuse me. Is that something new? Ooh, it is. Twin bow. Increase damage. Oh, now that's what you call it, the actual housing, housing crossbow. Okay, where do I go? Where do I go? Oof. Oh, okay, into the building. Is that a corpse? It is, then there's snakes. And it's raining. Whoa, I, I've... Okay, I think I've experienced the rain in this game, but... Not like this. Okay, I'm kind of scared what is in there. Possibly. Is there anywhere else I can get into? Now... No. Okay, not that. Oh wait. No, okay, no. It's water. And my freaking goddamn character doesn't know how to jump. <laughs> okay. <coughs> <clears throat> okay, no. <sighs> What's this? I am hearing something. No, 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 no. Leave me alone. 
I am not something that you'd like to eat. I'm way too scrawny. Okay, the creature is there. What do I need? Lights. Lights. Okay. Okay. Let's Wrote some notes. What did the notes say? I have to find a way out of the swamp and into the road that leads to the dam. Okay, find the generator noted. Ooh, that thing. You do not know that I'm here. I stepped on a little thing. There's a door there. What are you detecting? Okay. I miss my guns. Oh, I can harvest those? I thought I couldn't. I can harvest the mushrooms. Bleh. Okay, oops. Please don't. Okay. Is that something upstairs? Okay. Okay. Get me up. <laughs> no, okay. I have no... I need power to get up. Holy hell. They're behind me. Where is the generator is the question. Could it be that door? On the front? From over here? What do you mean? 
You have way too many filters. Okay, where? I need to be somewhere. But I don't know where is that. Wait, what? Wait, someone was talking. Ow. Where, where is this dude? Is there a way? Oh! Over here! Holy hell! Oh! Okay. Ah! I found it! Yep, giant roaches. <laughs> true, true. <laughs> They're the only things that will survive the nuclear fallout. Okay, I found the generator. Now the question is, does it have gas? Or do I just turn it on? Wait, I see something over there. You have power? Oh, perfect. Die, goodness me, stop it. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay, you guys are going to be pursuing me. Stop it. More? More of you? One more. More? Had enough? Can I get up there? No, I don't think so. Okay, I have to quickly make my way back. There. Oh. Wait, I think I saw something. Oh, ladder. Oh. I mean, the ladder is nothing.
They want to give me a hug. I don't want hugs. I hate hugs. Hugs from uh, from these things. So no, 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 no. Oh wait. Oops. Na 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 na. I don't want their hugs. <laughs> Perfect. I'm pretty sure I'd be electrocuted at this point. <laughs> Alright, now I can get up here. Is there someone called the Admiral here? This pistol. Never mind, there's snakes. There's no freaking way there's a shrimp up here. <laughs> oh, look at all this vegetation. Is there someone here? I'll assume someone would be behind this door. Hiya! Oh! Hello. No. Oh well. Um. Thank you for the slurpee and the pot. Ah, the oh. bandit. Well, you're here. Which means that all those spineless worms and wannabe pirates are all dead. Am I right? Don't bother answering. Everyone knows I'm right. And good riddance, I say. Perhaps we should offer him our hospitality, Admiral, sir. He is a guest, even though he's a bandit. That's an idea. Take a seat, Bandit. Let's have some tea. I bet you never tried anything quite like it. I gathered, dried, and brewed it myself. Can't get any help from this worthless lot. At least, they don't eat much. Hey, boys! You are one lonely person. You're yapping. It's making me worse racket than a damn aquas in heat. No respect for our guest either. He can't get a word in edgewise. Don't mind them. <laughs> to our meeting. To our meeting. That's a good tea. You fussy ground loving rats don't drink it though. <clears throat> radiation. Radiation. Radiation, my ass. Radiation. Just look at us. Danger. We're all healthy as can be. <laughs> Thanks for coming here. See how happy my boys are? <laughs> we don't really have anyone to talk to here anymore. They all left We're all but forgotten here. Oh, the crew is Even talking. Roland forgot about us. Yet he was here with us when we built this base. Roman. All the boys remember that. Don't you now? Yes, he was here. I remember. We all remember. That's right, boys. You all remember. But that bastard just forgot. And the other ground-loving rats, too. They all forgot. We're protecting them all with our lives here. At first... They were so happy. 
They shouted, Who kill all the bandits? The pioneers are cowards! The teacher is wrong! We're better off attacking! Didn't they, boys? Yeah, they did! They shouted their throats sore! Yeah, louder than those bandits we shot! There you have it! My boys, do remember! And those, don't! You could always count on them when you wanted someone to shout and call pioneers names! Aye, but when the going got tough, and the Aquas started attacking in their hundreds, they changed their tune. Oh, radiation! Oh, it's dangerous! Oh, the girls say, teacher told them to tell us that we have to get out! Well, fighting the Aquas ain't as fun as hanging bandits from the posts. You can rob the bandits when you kill them, but mutants don't have much worth taking. So who cares if they're about to eat the whole valley, right? Pathetic rats. That's who they are. Ground-loving rats. A bit late to start listening to the teacher, too. Though, those rats don't care whom they listen to. Be it teacher or the girls. If doing so gives them an excuse for chickening out. Wow. So, they all left. The cowards. Oh, thanks. Uh, all right. Thank you. <sighs> Even the pioneers have more spine than that slime. They followed Ludmila to the dam. They were going to take the tunnels and then <laughs> go along the reservoir, those adventurers. I've no idea if they actually got anywhere. But they weren't afraid of no radiation, that's for certain. Mm -hmm. Well, the only person who still has balls in that sorry lot is Olga. She did visit us a lot here, and she always thrashed those cowards at council sessions. Oh, this is one of the last ones. It's you who she visited! <laughs> yeah, right. Me! Though, if not for my spine wound, Olga and I would have turned this valley upside down. But now, who needs a cripple? <laughs> to hell with her! A woman on a ship is bad luck. Besides, we stayed with you. Yes, my boys did stay here. I had to do some persuading to make them stay, though. Uh, yep, you persuaded them permanently. Weren't you? Weren't you? Come on, Admiral, sir. We'd never do that. Yeah, yeah. Tell that to this new guy. He seems to be all ears. But I can read you all like a book and I say you are going to leave me and had I not brewed my tea extra super strong that day you would have no doubt about that hey careful with the guitar got it sir I'll be careful come on remember this thing is an instrument! Yes, sir. An instrument! What the hell is up with you today? Do you want to scrub the deck so bad? Sorry, Admiral. Don't be sorry. Be better! How about you play something instead of dropping that guitar? I'd go for a shanty. Yes, Admiral. One shanty to coming up. To hell, you're all brown loving rats. Rats. Yes, I've been thinking. Why don't we have a smoke? I say we should. Oh, this is good. This tea 
is as good for smoking as it is for brewing. It can also cure any sickness and solve your marital problems. <laughs> Just stay here with us. Living here is fun. We can talk, eat, and drink all we want. We'll find you a bunk tomorrow. I'll take a bath in the meantime. Just a little rest. Good tea. Good tea. Ooh. Well, that's kind of sad. I actually like the music of this game. I gotta say thank you for the tea, but I need to go. What is this thing? C'est la vie. Oh, I have radio. I have radio frequency. My wife is in trouble. All right, goodbye, Admiral. <laughs> All right. Wow, I have been through here, huh? Am I hearing a bear? What do you mean, girl? Am I be? Am I gonna meet the bear again? I swear. Okay, how many bullets do I have? Not that many, but at least I have some. Okay, before I start moving any forward, let me do this. Okay, let me check this. Can I check this? Look at that. A tank. 
All right. Let's move on forward. Oh my... <laughs> oh no, there's no freaking way the bear is back. Quick save here, Vivid. All right. Oh my God, spiders! No, uh, 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 no. Uh, uh. Get the hell away from me, please. Oh, la. Reckon <laughs> kinda I hate you. <laughs> Ooh. Oh no. Oh <laughs> Na 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 you you guys leave me alone. This is so bad. This is so bad, I don't have my gun! I don't have my weapons like before. That I can burn them. I mean, I have Molotov. Okay, set that to the Molotov. I am burning everything that is by. No. Stay away from me. <laughs> it's another spider section. I am just worried about the spiders. That's all. How are you? Spider bug, spider bug. What in the world is happening? Oh no. Okay. It disabled my flashlight. I am left with my lighter. Oh god. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <gasps> my lighter is not enough for this! I'm not wasting my bullets unless I actually needed to. <laughs> Where 
Where's the next torch? It's right there in the end. Get back. Shoo. This is so bad. This is so bad. Light it up, light it up, light it up. <laughs> oh god. Why? No, 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 no. Light it up, light it up, baby. The light is my friend. The light is my friend. Who's this? Ooh. What is happening to my crossbow? Check this other room. Oh. This room. Oh. Not a good idea, but okay. How are you, Raccoon? Okay, thank you. Yes, give me all of those. Oh, this is over here. Okay. Living day by day. That's good. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Oh, this is the worst when the the flashlight is not working at all. Thank goodness for the Molotovs, but holy hell. It Jamming? Oh, are you talking about my flashlight in the game yeah it is getting jammed so electrical jam 
so it wouldn't be able to function. Where am I? Alright. I searched that side already. There's nothing on this side. Okay. Yes, they're in. A freaking aliens type of egg sacs, holy hell. <sighs> Wait, can I throw... What about I burn these big ass nests? What happens? They're continuously burning. <gasps> oh no. Why is it so bulbous? Okay. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I think we learned that I can break the X hex, but wait, where do I go? Do I need to find something? The, this is the only good thing about the crossbow. Okay, I need to backtrack? Is there something that I missed? Possibly in here? Uh oh, no, no, no. Oh, maybe that thing. Oh, it might be blocking a generator or something. Oh god, I can't see where I'm going.
get over here. Yeah, over here. I got this one. <gasps> uh oh. Oh, I can't destroy it. Is that all? It seems like I can go there, but... Am I missing something? I can't crawl through these things. And this is where I came from. Hmm. <laughs> Good night, Raccoon Roswell. Thank you for dropping by. Am I supposed to burn this? Can I make a Molotov? Thank you for the pet! God damn it, I cannot. That's a problem. This is terrifying to hear. Oh! Can you crawl through here? I didn't realize. Okay. Ooh, this is a catacomb. <laughs> I just used all of my... Okay, the females are a problem. Okay, I think I got them. Holy hell. Oh, no, no, no. Not all of them. That's one female.
I don't care, I'm burning all of you. Holy hell. Yeah, that's another nest. Hopefully I can find... Molotovs. It was a mistake on my part on that time. Uh. Mm -mm. Oh, found something. This wait, hold on. Uh, I found it. Gas, right? Or I need to fill it. Okay, I need to find gas for fuel. What's this? Get off my face, please. So something. Can't burn it? Really? I believe this is another spider section. Holy heck. Why can't I make freaking molotovs on the go? Which is ridiculous. There we go. Here's what I need. Ah, oh, perfect. Sayonara. Damn you. Can I explode this? Mm. Eh, hello. Okay. Is this my uh, way out? Finally?
Okay, perfect. Um, not really. Not really my way out. Fully. Yet. There's a note. <gasps> a workbench. Oh! <gasps> I'm so happy! I need my gear cleaned. Oh my god. Oh, perfect. Okay, five of those. One of these, I guess. Repair these. <clears throat> Alright, I'm quote unquote stacked. <sighs> Before I get out, yeah, maybe this. Had a thing, but okay, just in case. Let me make more molotovs. I need the molotovs. <laughs> I don't care. Okay, there we go. And for the arrows. Explosive types, but okay. I'm ready. Is that a freaking rat just there? I'm assuming the bear is gonna drop down here. Once I climb up there. This looks like a fr freaking nest for it. Yeah, like look at all the bodies.
it's a long drop. Right. Hey, done with work. That's good, that's good. <gasps> Alyosha! Al, my buddy, my womanizing buddy, you're alive! It's been so long, I've been so lonely. My friend. Come get some! Akiom? Damn, you're alive! I'm so glad to see you. And I just managed to get in contact with the Aurora. Uh, mm -hmm. Your word. And I get that. This place isn't as simple as it first seems. Come, I'll show you. Are you talking about the dam? Let's go, Akio. Wait, hold on. Let me save a little bit. Can I check this place out? Uh oh. Oh, I can. Okay. Oh, wow. Can I look around here? Oh, did you attack them? Oh well. <laughs> I missed the spot, but it's okay. It was the first location that I ever missed. Okay, noted. I don't want to go there. Okay, let's get to my goal first. Because I feel like I might need to come back here. Yeah, I might be forced to come back here anyway. Yeah? Hear the counter react? There's a hell of a lot of radioactive sediment behind that concrete. And soon? will bring an end to this valley mm -hmm. because the dam barely holds use your binoculars if you don't believe me we can't stay here Nobody oh can, really no I see yeah ah well she did zip one 
Those kids built it back when there wasn't as much seepage. That's where we need to go. The old man said the Aurora will soon be on the dam. We gotta hurry. I think something's wrong with the Aurora. It seems that Anna is not doing too good. We'll know more soon. Yep. Yeah, I know. Ah, uh, goddammit. Okay, now to save my life. Sliding down here. I gotta tell you, I met this awesome girl here. She's dropped dead gorgeous. Yeah. Name's it's a kid. An instructor. Everyone respects her. Plus, she's pretty understanding. Believe me when I said we're not enemies. Mm hmm. To say goodbye, I asked her to come with us. Ah, I can't leave them all. Sorry, buddy. I know you're talking there, but you know. I hope Phil can persuade all those guys to leave and leaves herself. That is true. Oh, I don't God. Like it's not a feeling, buddy. It's a bear. You're not supposed to feel it. You're supposed to hear it. But I'm fighting a freaking bear again. Can you go ahead first, or...? God damn it, is there no other way I can just, you know, hop down and then climb up? Okay, fine. How did I get stuck under a rock? My friend got to save the- No 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 no! Uh oh. Uh oh. L. L. I'm gonna have to fight it. How are you? Oh no. Gotta keep on moving, gotta keep on moving, gotta get <laughs> it's really, really, it's really happy. <laughs> Not fair. Oh god. <laughs> get down, buddy. Get down, get down, get down, get down. Oh. Okay, gotta circle around. Yep, it's a bear part mole. Ah! <laughs> <I'm ice. sighs> uh, no, 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 uh oh, 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 uh oh,
Oh god. Artyom, come on! Do I need this? <gasps> I need to burn it. I'm gonna burn it. it. <laughs> oh my god, don't. Not you there. Sorry, no, it's either you or me. <sighs> what an enormous beast! Well, Artyom, help me here. Let's restore this line's tension. I'm alive. you people they just needed passage are you sure you're not coming i'm sorry Alesha. i can't just stop and breathe like this no matter how much i like in this case i bid you farewell my third lady ah there with it olga i'll be back i'll be waiting artyom let's go <laughs> my romantic bro Oh my god. You guys may have a horn. Anna is in bad shape. You must move. Time is short. Neither the air nor the drugs we found along the way are of any help now. The illness has progressed too far. Maybe it's not... I think it's radiation that's got into her? Oh no, my wife. We all remained silent while the Aurora was running along the poison sea held at bay by the dam. We believed we'd be back. Now, having seen the sword of Damocles hanging over the valley, we knew it was not meant to be. Alyosha is especially worried. His old guy's there. Perhaps he will be able to warn her via radio and save the people there. What happens next? I have no idea. I am ready for anything. Anything but one thing. Anna, please, hold on. Without you, I have nothing to live for. Nothing to dream about. Doubly so, since if not for that dream of mine, you'd be all right now. Oh, and this is so sad. <coughs> Artyom, you know when I found this photo of the Pacific Ocean, I just knew for some reason that we were going to go there in the end. All these rivers, mountains, deserts, they just won't do. It's ocean or bust. I believed we could make it. I did. I know I'll get there. And if I need some help, you'll be there for me. You'll save me again, won't you? <coughs> Our 
Tiong, please, stop torturing yourself. It hurts to even look at you. You and Dad, too. It's not your dream, and not his belief in the occupying forces. It's just fate. A stupid piece of cloth in the wind. What, in concrete? An idiotic ammo dump? <coughs> Let her sleep a bit. <coughs> it's winter again. Oh, this is just so sad. Come with me, Bratuma. <laughs> there are things to discuss. Hey, Sorry, quest for your stuff. What in the world are you doing, sir? After all, it's just a cold. We'll fix it in no time. And then Anna? We'll fix her too. As soon as we find the medicine, she'll start getting better. For real? You have my word, so don't you worry. All right, I won't. My mom says the Spartans always keep their word. That is true, Nastya. Indeed. Hey, Sam. Don't worry, Arkin. Everything will be okay. Anna is strong. Olga, Alyosha here. An online is bronze. I hope you can hear me. Examine the dam and reservoir. You have to leave the valley as soon as possible. At least before the rainy season starts. The dam is barely holding, and if it gives, the valley will be washed away, and everything that remains will be deadly. Leave tomorrow, or even better, yesterday. Talk to the other girls. Get them to raise the issue at the council session. Even the pirates will have to obey if it passes. Just leave me a note so that I know which what end the? of the world to follow you to once I'm back. With this, I have to bid you farewell. At least until tomorrow. Au revoir. I hope she heard that. Radio's in the church after all. But with Olga, even Satan herself wouldn't stop her, much less a stupid taboo. That's my diary, but okay. Right. Oh, this is meat. Okay. Indicate errors. Today, though, I found. 
on some small thing. The thing is radiation levels way outside of normal operational range of the scanner are also marked as errors. <laughs> Simply put, the radiation there may well be completely off the scale. We're about 500 clicks from Novosibirsk and the radiation outside wow. is almost as high as back in Moscow. There. Ah, the shots are 20 years old. The radiation can't be quite as high now, but still, Novosibirsk is most probably so what do we do now? I'll tell you what we do. Artyom and I will go. This is not right. the other way. We go together. No, sir. Not Please. our first. She is my daughter. His wife. My paranoia about the occupation forces drove her into that damned bunker. And Artyom with his dream. He dragged us out of Moscow. So we too are to blame. We are one crew, and we should all act accordingly. We should all go. Discussion is closed. This is not an order mission. It is a personal errand, mine and Artyom's. We don't need any help. Second, we don't know the exact location of the medicine. It might be in the city center, or in one of the Akadem Gorodok labs. Tarana's life might well end up in your hands, too. Third and last, wherever we might go, Winter is coming, and getting the Aurora stuck in snow is what? That's something we can't allow. Do you remember what Yermak said? Uh, remind them, please. In the huge railway technology museum at the city outskirts, we'll almost certainly find a snowplow for the Aurora there. So, gentlemen, <laughs> your missions are to search the Akadem Gorodot labs and prepare Aurora for the winter. For the mission. Also, we are starting constant radiation level monitoring outside. Effective immediately. Sam, you're first. Yes, sir. I think that lethal radiation levels there are actually good news for us. Uh, you mean there was nobody left of the drugstores and hospitals? <laughs> exactly. Unlike the towns we've been to. Mm -hmm. Makes sense, but Colonel, sir, an update on the suits. Yes, what's the situation? I managed to assemble only two complete ones. You see, they're for Artyom and me. It's fate, that's what it is. <sighs> Will they help? Well, they'll protect you from dust, but even the direct radiation there is so high. Nice, thank you. We aren't exactly attending a dance party there. How much time will it give us? A couple of hours. Not enough, I think. Better than nothing. Don't worry. We'll make through. Always have. I'll add some lead shielding to the guard's cabin. Try to stay inside for as long as you can out there. <laughs> Yes, not at all close. But they still got everything there, including the most curious. 
has engines from all over the country. And some 15 years before the war, the museum was open. I see. But why are you so sure there's a snowplow there? I know it, because they transported it there from Moscow. Ha! Huh, it's a great specimen. You'll like it for sure. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm quite sure about that. Well, I guess I'll go. Tokarev okay, might need some help there. It's going to be a freaking miracle if Anna survives. Where? How? There's a whole sector blotted out on the image. And look at its location. Sure, the Akadem Gorodok is rather bad, but not too dangerous if we don't waste time there. Akadem Gorodok. See? Sure, it's not the city center, but still, the only place we'd find there would be an early grave. We'll see about that. There's nothing to see. Do you think Colonel didn't send us there just because he forgot about it? Sure, I don't yep. I understand. I'm not that dumb after all. Так, слушай, what are we even talking about then? The Colonel said the discussion was closed. They already decided everything with Artyom, and we must respect their decision and believe that it will all work out. Because we are what? Sparta. Exactly. So let us be good and go back to planning our route to that lab. All right. We are Sparta. I think we can avoid the main hotspot if we went this way. So the purple ones are like the main areas Maybe here. of the radiation. An impact, and then the green areas is the quote unquote lingering ones. Okay. Oh, yeah, I can hear the Geiger working. Artyom, I wanted to say, look, I, I spent 20 years with you people. We almost burnt the planet down trying to kill each other once. We should be enemies, I guess. No, you're my friend. Luck to you too. Actually, good luck to us all. Alright. Poor Sam, he's kind of like. <laughs> I guess the Americans were the one that dropped down the nuclear in Moscow or in, in this country. And he just happens to be there at the time. Oh, I can put stuff here. Wait. <clears throat> Let me put some. Let's check back here. The medicine is called Drenergen F, and she was completely amazed by it. Mind you, she was a real doctor, unlike me. Katya, hmm. believe me, your mother would be proud of you. Thank you, Alyosha. I hoped I could help, but Anna's case seems to be extremely unfortunate. 
That gas on the Volga lost most of its punch already, but it was enough to start the destructive process. Of course, the hopes I had for the valley and its air were naive, but even the valley in the end. Yes, air, water, and the forest. It's all there, but I'm afraid not for long. A pity. The people there are actually quite nice. We'd find some common ground. Is the dam in such danger? It is, but even if it could hold out for years more, a third of the valley is already polluted with radiation. All the fallout was accumulating at the bottom of the reservoir for years and years, and now it's seeping through. Yet if the dam fails... I hope she, they, listen to my advice. Do you love her? Yes. If it is fate, you'll meet her again, definitely. Well, I'll go check up on Anna. Sure. Tell her I said hi. Hey there, buddy. Okay, let me check up on people first. Hello. Ah, Artyom. You know you're just being unfair. Colonel and you take the exciting mission, and we all get the boring one. <laughs> what do you mean is exciting? Again? You can die. I have died if multiple we times. Together, we find what we need in half an hour tops. While with just two of you, it's going to take forever. Ah, uh, well, we'll finish our task in Academ Garadok and come help you. Academ Garadok. Okay. Though, I bet you'd find a way to make it a boring chore, like at that bridge. With the targets lined up like in a shooting gallery, but no, you have to spare those loons. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll be a Mr. Nice Guy. You're not gonna say anything, Damir? No? No? Okay. Why do I feel like it's a very bad situation at the moment? Where. Don't worry, you'll live. Is there a workshop? Whatever. You know what? I think I might stick to the housing. I'm gonna play with it. What changed? Oops, sorry. Okay, I'm actually curious how this would be. But this one, I'll change. Gatling. Replace. Oh, no, 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 no. Where is my shotgun collage shambler? Is it a shambler? Oh, yeah, it is. Alright, Shambler. And then... This one. I know it's not the collage. Bulldog. Ah, yeah. 
I'm replacing all my guns. should be good. Okay, I feel like I need this more. Right. Yes, Artyom. I never told this story before, but I'd like you to listen. You see, I had this Tokarev pistol. That fail-proof thing that had failed me once. It was a great gun. Powerful. Punched through any body armor you could still move in. But it only had eight bullets. And that just proved not enough. I came upon some bandits tormenting a family. And I just couldn't. So I snapped and got all of them. Save for one. The fucker hit me hard. By the time the other people arrived, I was half dead. Thought they were angels. Anyhow, here's why I'm telling you this now. There are more of us now than I had bullets then. So, I'm sure we can take whatever the world throws at us and win! Thank you for always taking care of our weapons, aka our gear. I don't think anyone is back here. Hmm? Oh, there's a note. Alright, let's get to the diary. Let's sit here. <sighs> <laughs> oh well, that dude is gone. Ooh. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, is that Olga? Never mind. Okay, let's check this thing. Emmental Tiger. I can't say if I've ever been religious, but right now I'm begging all gods, please watch over Anna and make the valley cure her of her affliction. In the meantime, Alyosha and I are the recon mission. We have no idea of what is waiting for us there. Though Alyosha seems convinced that there are going to be crowds of women eagerly anticipating his arrival. If that turns out to be the case, then I have to be the best companion possible for this mission. Well, Alyosha, with whom we were sent on a mission to recon the valley ahead, was marveling at the vistas and giddily anticipating the meetings of a local woman. I was begging all gods to make the valley air cure Anna of her illness. My prayers had an unexpected effect, though. With a tired sigh, a considerable chunk of the valley side had decided to slide down into the river taking the rails and our rail car along with it. The water is ice cold and the current was so strong I had no chance fighting it. I ended up dropping my backpack and weapons, but still got dragged into some stones and hit my head. Having regained my senses and climbed out of the water, I decided to put as much distance between myself and the river as I could and enter the forest. After a short walk, I found a man tied up and left there so that the wolves could rip his guts out. He didn't look trustworthy, and those had left him there could have been right, but it was simply too much. There must be some difference between people and wolves after all. Having cut the rope, I left immediately. I didn't want to make a small talk with him, and it, it was a good call. Later I learned that the locals hated all intruders and I could hardly blame them for that. Not from far from the place where I woke up, there were ruins of a children's summer camp. Despite its sorry state, the camp was not completely abandoned. As there, I walked into some locals. Luckily, they didn't mistake me for a bandit and shoot me. Still, the way they warned me to not enter their turf was way too crass, and I took offense to that. Judging by their choice of words, they were out shopping for a fight, and this time they bought more than they bargained for. Perhaps I should have gone easier on them, but I had to cross their territory and get to my destination, and they didn't have time for convincing them to just let me through peacefully. Had I had a way of contacting the Aurora, I would have probably just arranged for proper negotiations. But my radio got drenched, and fixing it was a complete impossibility, as both Tokarev and Kras remained in the Aurora. After some wandering in the forest, I managed to get caught in the primitive trap, standing around the net that kept me suspended. My captors were discussing who would get my boots. 
They reminded me of kids who too immersed in a game or something. These children of the forest were caught by the war in the camp, but managed to survive despite the attacks from bandits and mutants. As far as I understood, eventually they divided into two factions, the pirates and the pioneers. Both similarly respected the word of some teacher, but seemed to differ in its interpretation. <laughs> I get the music. The pirates were more aggressive, ready to attack their perceived enemies, whoever might those be. While the pioneers, whom I considered more civilized of the two, appeared more isolationist. Concentrated on protecting their turf, had we met under different circumstances, we might have reached an agreement with them. The time, though, we had definitely started off the wrong foot. I have no idea whom would my boots eventually go to, as the conversation was rather suddenly joined by a giant mutant bear that chased my ill-fated captors away. This was not to be my last time meeting the master of the forest, as the locals call him, setting off the direction the surviving hunters vanished into. I found one of them mortally wounded by the bear. It was my backpack he recovered from the river that kept him from running fast enough. I was ready to help him in any way I could, but sadly, it was too late. I wish I could do something for him as thanks for returning the vital piece of my gear I, con I considered lost forever. I had to find Alyosha as soon as possible. I heard the hunter say that he was alive and waiting a session of some forest court in their main camp up the river. I had to free him before the verdict had passed. By the time I arrived in the camp, Alyosha had already left. But at least I was able to listen in on a session of the instructor's council, where the pirates openly told of their plans to attack the Aurora. While the pioneers insisted on sticking to purely defensive tactics. The hostility of the pirates was somewhat understandable, as ever since the war, the only visitors these people were bandits and marauders, which they had to fight to the death. No wonder they weren't expecting anything nice from the crew. Despite their usual ferocity towards their enemies, manifest in withered bandits, corpses hanging from the posts all over the valley. Apparently, there was a girl among the pioneers who, in secret from the others, let my friend go. Did she simply take pity on him? Or did his fabled magnetism actually work? It certainly looked like this lady killer was not wrong in anticipating an adventure. I heard a local say he was going towards the old church which we had noticed from the railroad, so that place seemed worth checking out. At the base of the church, though, I was greeted by the master of the forest, aka the bear. Here, this beast used to have no equals, but I thought it that man is, in fact, the apex predator. The bear ruled the forest, but we once ruled the whole world. It should have been thankful to me for not being in the mood of killing. I only wanted to get to the church, otherwise the bear would have been dead. On my way, there was a tiny abandoned village, an outpost of the children of the forest, which the bandits had captured and used to rally their forces in preparation of a serious push towards the main camp. While the locals didn't exactly give me a warm welcome, I couldn't let the bandits torture their prisoners freely. After getting rid of the executioners, I left. I couldn't really wait for help from the camp to arrive. Time was running short. Instead of Alyosha, in the church I found Olga, the girl who had set him free. As I suspected, Alyosha was going to wait for me at the dam. So that's where I went next. Olga told me that to get to the dam, I needed a boat, 
and even explain where to find one. I should remember to tell Alyosha that she said hi. To reach the dam, I had to cross a poisoned swamp where the pirates had set up a veritable fortress to defend the valley from the advancing mutants. I must give credit where credit is due. These people had courage to spare. They proudly stood in the way of implacable threat that set on destroying their tiny world. Just like our order defending the metro. Losing people and ground backing up ever further into the tunnels with every passing year. Fully understanding the futility of our struggle, but still refusing to surrender. However, the fort not only protected the valley from the mutants, but was also blocking my way to the dam. I had no choice, really. It was better to attack first than wait till they noticed and surround me. In any case, it didn't look like the locals were going to run out of brave fighters anytime soon. After crossing the swamp, I ended up in a dark maintenance tunnel densely populated with the, my old friends, the spiderbugs. Having reached the fresh air again, I finally saw Alyosha. The dam was really closed and everything seemed to be coming together. But it was too early to celebrate. The master of the forest was on our trail and catching up fast. There was no way avoiding the fight to the death. And if not for Alyosha's timely intervention, the bear would have taken me along on the dive off the high cliff and straight into the sharp rocks. When Alyosha and I were getting ready to cross the final gorge before the dam using the zipline, the children of the forest caught up with us. Luckily, they were led by Olga, an instructor well respected by the hunters. Alyosha had the good luck of getting acquainted with her during his stay in their camp. So, we were let go peacefully. Still aboard of Aurora, there were bad news waiting for us. Anna's health had gotten much worse. Oh, it's autumn. We all remained silent while the Aurora was running along the poisoned sea held by the bay by the dam. We believe we'd be back now, having seen the sword of Damocles hanging over the valley. We knew it was not meant to be. Alyosha is especially worried his Olga is there. Perhaps he will be able to warn her via radio and save the people there. What happens next? I have no idea. I'm ready for anything else. But one thing. Anna, please, hold on. Without you, I have nothing to live for. Nothing to dream about. Doubly so, since if not for that dream of mine, you'd be alright now. Yeah. It's so rough. Let's see. And, uh. Anything updated on her? I guess this one. Anna, my love. It's all my fault. I took too long to get you out of that damn silo where you got poisoned. God, what do I do? During Stepan and Katya's wedding, Anna just collapsed and started coughing up blood. The poison has been slowly destroying her lungs. We have nothing to treat her this with. The best we can do is ease her pain and hope for a miracle. Anna keeps a brave facade, makes jokes. She's no damsel, but a real fighter. But I just can't help asking myself questions. Could I have prevented this? Is it all my fault? How do I save her? 
God, how much time does she even have left? My fault is wider and deeper than just that. It was I who dragged Anna, my dearest Anna, out of Moscow. Out of the metro where she could have lived in a normal life. Could have given birth to children. Our children. Drag her where? To her death. In the river valley where the fresh air was supposed to cure her. The very valley we had to fight through half the country to reach. And Anna got even worse now. Her only chance is Renner... Gan F. The medicine mentioned in the notes left by Katya's mother. And to give Anna a chance. I'm ready to die. We are going to no no Novosibirsk. <laughs> I'm so sorry if I butchered that. Oh my god. Okay, Miller. What updated with you? Okay, there. It was Anna's illness that finally reconciled us. He used to blame me for everything. After all, if not for my dodge research, search for other survivors, none of this would have ever happened. I used to blame him too. If not for his conviction that there were occupying forces all over the place, Anna would never have fallen into that silo. He considered me to be delusional and egotistic. I hated his close-mindedness and stubbornness, but I now feel the pain. His inability to help the situation in any way causes him. He lost everything, all because of me, his only daughter, and my beloved wife, Anna. Is all he has left to live for now. Thus, we must forget everything that stands between us to save her, or at least give our best trying. Does Idiot have any updates? No. Alyosha. Oh. And in the river valley where we had such high hopes for. Where we sunk Chris's rail car and we almost killed ourselves, Alyosha just found that the love of his life. As he himself puts it, he found her and almost immediately had to leave her behind since he, like a good friend that he is, couldn't abandon us before we reached our goal. In Novor Novosibirsk, there. I'm sure that he will come back to his Olga. After all, Alyosha hates farewells too much to never return. Sam... Is there anything about you? Oh. Oh, okay. No, Sam. The war is over. It was over the moment it started. You don't have to choose your side. All the choices have been made for us. You, like all of us, need only to remain a human. And that is all. We are with you, your brothers in arms. <laughs> the soldiers of the Order, with you against the whole wild world and in the order there are no nationalities without you we'd have been forever stayed in the Yamantau bunker eaten by our own ex-compatriots who had long since stopped being human beings that's the way it goes man <laughs> i think about you sometimes sam now that our journey is nearing its end be it <laughs> happy or otherwise what will you do you dedicated your whole being to us first to the order then to saving our commander and finally to saving my anna 
But what will you do once our train reaches the end of its line? In the middle of nowhere. Will you stay with us when the journey is really over? Your old man might still be waiting for you back in California. Keeping tackle ready to go fishing once you come back. Aren't you going to visit him once the aurora stops to never move again? Will he even hesitate to set out for home? Even if that would mean walking to Vladivostok and swimming across the ocean. Oh, that's just sad. What about Stepan? Okay. Tokora, nothing. Katya Nasya. Oh, they do have. Okay. Uh. That's when trouble struck. Katya is beside herself with her worry. And she blames herself for misattributing the symptoms of Anna's poisoning. Katya managed to stabilize Anna's condition after the bout during the wedding. And she says she knows how to cure my wife. But she obviously doubts her own incompetence. Constantly comparing herself with her mom. Who used to be a real doctor and scientist. The Renergan medicine Katya told us about seems to be Anna's only hope. There's nothing else to laugh for, to hope for. So I have to believe that this medicine's power and Katya's ability. Katya promised me to make sure that Anna survives our trip to, no to Novo, no matter what. We only need to get there, then it all depends on me, Katya. Please be alright. Please be right. Yeah. You are not Sephardic oil children of the forest. Creatures. Look at the bear, goddammit. And then the wolf. And then weapons. The Helsing and Relagon. Yep. Uh. Okay. I know there's a spot where it's not that noisy. Okay, there now. I know I collected a lot. I haven't been able to collect any postcard at all. Other than this. <sighs> what is this? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Guys, I'm at the lower farm with about 30 bandits. I've been leading them from the road. We'll hold them for half an hour, maybe. Losing too much blood. I'm sending the little one back with this message because he wouldn't leave otherwise. Good luck, guys. Siri. Okay. Hmm. What is this? I think I read these things. Oh, there you go. Hello again, Liuda. Speaking of madmen, the admiral with his crew are staying put at the old lumber mill. Would you imagine that? He says that rather than sit here and wait for the mutants to come ashore, He's gonna shoot them in the water. They're all crazy, but they're ready to risk everything to make the lives of others a bit safer. And I couldn't talk them out of it no matter what. And you thought I abandoned people like this? I'm sorry. I just can't. Good luck to you guys again. You're Alex. Oh. 
This is... There was no real car up there. Why did we even think it would be? Sure, the marauders used it to come here, but wouldn't they leave someone to guard it? So, when that someone understood that the others were not going to come back, he just left with it. And it looks like we're not coming back either. The spiders were just making noises in the dark corners while we were going there. But on the way back, they pounced us as soon as we shut the gate. Not that coming back would do us any good. Roman is not forgiving, not a forgiving type. Lyuda would be able to talk him into letting us back, but she had her mind set on leaving, and she left. On foot, no less. Gotta admire her guts, but still, she's crazy. Then again, she actually... she could actually get somewhere. It's time, the spiders are close. Farewell, everyone. Ooh. It was a mistake. We shouldn't have left. I should have stayed with Roman. Then I could still hope there was a real life somewhere out there, behind the dam, and the guys would be alive. Now I know what's out there. It's a sea, and less of radioactive water. All the pus of this gangrenous world is gathered there, to one day flood the tiny sandbox that was our universe for so many years. The dam won't last long. The reservoir used to be much smaller. And now, I walk for a week. Didn't see the end of it. If you find this letter, please tell the others in the valley. And then again, what's the point? It's not like there's anywhere they could go. Everything is coming to an end. Just like the gas in my lamp. I don't want the spiders to get me. The whole thing seems so stupid now. Alex, I'm sorry. Oh, this is the... Girl, I think. I just note, boys, the medicine is called Renegrin F. But besides it, be on the lookout for antibiotics. The best we could would be ciproflux, ciprofloxacin, and amoxicillin. But grab whichever you find, anyways. We won't get her to novel if we let an infection to add gas damage also to try to find some ethamisolate misolate i only have two doses of left some medicinal medical gelatin in case bleeding does start again if you see anything else like antiseptic surgical suture and bandages pack it all we can never have too much of that but still first things come first Ugh. it's rough Alright. I was doing wall sits while reading. Uh, you're reading really have. Aw, thank you. I'm glad that it helped. <laughs> oh, the wolf? Yeah, I kind of look like just a scrawny, you know, bear cub. But the drawings are actually nice to see in this game. Look at that. Alright. Now, to the next stop. Let's go save my wife! Ama isn't giving up. She believes in me. Believes in us. And for a good reason. Thousands of kilometers of track behind us. We are finally approaching Novosibirsk, a dead city concealing her hope for life, the medicine that could save her, somewhere in its cold, irradiated heart. Uh -oh. A year ago, we left the poisoned ruins of Moscow, and now we are about to enter another city stiff in the murderous embrace of winter and radiation. Will we ever find somewhere to live on the surface? Maybe. But for now, we're returning back into the bowels of Metro. Back to Savannah. Alright. I'm 
crawling back into the tunnels of a metro. Oh god, look at just he listen to that Geiger. Is that you, Sam? Climbing like crazy. I think there'll be no nutcases this time. I hope I'm not gonna be fighting any more mutants. That's better. The houses are undamaged too. Sam, what's with the radiation? Eight Whoa. times higher than in Moscow and still climbing, Colonel. I think we better not stay outside for too long here. Ooh. Yeah, that's way too high. Yes. Follow me. Father in law. Rely on us. Yep. Alright. It's an adventure with my father in law this time. This looks better than in Moscow. Refresh the plan, Yermak. We'll take the Aurora south to the Sibilskaya cargo station. Uh, I must see Stefan. Chris, Sam, Idiot, and I will handle the Institute building in Akadem Gorodok. We'll pay a visit to the railroad museum on the way. <laughs> there might be something oh, for sir. the Aurora there. I've stayed to guard the Aurora with Tokarev. Good. Why Our is your leg so spread like that? is way too high here, so we'll try to get there through the metro. Well, let's get to it. Good luck, Spartans. Good, Good luck. luck. Good luck. <laughs> is that away, is that normal for military people to You're just spread their legs like that? Here, because I know you. Good luck. Well, good luck, everyone. We each each of us have our own missions. Right. Good luck, Sorry, Bill. I'll bring back the old man, don't worry. Unless the the game decides to, you know. We will get. Yes. Um, could you please watch over her for us until Artem and I come back? Please? Of course. Teddy and I will be her guard. Will you help me, Teddy? Drive at Teddy and make sure acknowledged. Goodbye, Uncle Tom. Bye bye. It's a very cute button. Don't worry about Aunt Anna. Daddy and I will watch over her. Okay. Hush, shh. She's sleeping. Are you reading? Yes. I hope we'll make it in time. No, we will. Anna is strong. She'll be here for you. She definitely will. Just make sure you come back. Thank you, Katya. Come in, Artyom. Oh, thank you. Uh, I was about to say, like, can I not come in to see my wife one more time? The attack ended. I did my best. So you don't have to worry. Her pulse is strong. She's just exhausted. She'll probably sleep till tomorrow now. Okay. My poor wife, I will come back to you. Don't worry about it. 
Don't worry, I'll bring your dad back as well, but yes. Alright. She'll be fine. Come back soon. Seeing you would be the best medicine. Yep. Anna is strong. She will win this fight. Just make sure you come back. Is she supposed to have a mask over her face because the audio of her character be like, yeah. Oh well. Good luck, Tom. Thank you. There's my gear, I think. Artyom, this is no Moscow. You could loiter outside for months. Who knows what monsters live here? So think well what to pack. I'll be waiting at the car. Oh my god, I keep forgetting that the Miller holds a big ass gun. Thank you. Thank you, bro. Think what in the world is that? Oh, I already placed everything. Chandler, Bulldog, right. ammo. How am I looking in ammo? Okay. I might risk having bullets. Okay, good thing I have the freaking thing. With it or on it. Onwards. Wow, this is actually cooler. You ready? We are. Yep. Wait, are we driving? <gasps> the, the car. Our last chance to save Anna. We must make it count. Don't worry, we will. Artyom, promise me this one thing: you guys get there and back quickly. We cure Anna. And we all go back to searching for a place to live. Okay? You did such a good job on the freaking vehicle. Oh my goodness. Imagine if people actually place paddings on cars. Oh, the old man is driving. Okay. He even replaced the, the glass on the, on the doors. Okay, I'm Overwatch method. We are her last hope now. I am more worried what could be out there. Holy hell. Alright. So, how do you find the road to your dream? Do you wish we never set out? I can see that. Well, let's put those feelings away for the moment, Artyom. We can handle this. Right on with the old man. I think we can get out from there. Hold on. Uh, I'm definitely holding on. If the radiation is that high... No, no, no. I'll assume that there will always be some sort of beast that can withstand freaking high radiation. But what would it be eating though? Oh, 
Oh. Okay. Wait, we're, we're getting out? We're definitely not entering the metro through here. And too much snow. Oh, that's a metro thing. Okay. Take the wheel, Artyom. I'll handle the navigation. We'd better use the map here. No time for driving in circles. Okay. All right. The map puts the metro entrance quite close to our position. Quite close. What do you mean? Okay, you navigate. I I steer. Where? Left, right. Is there anything in the left? Get right side. This road should get us to the city center. Then take it, but keep looking around. There might be a way into the metro on the way. Mm -hmm. oh, so much snow, and the storm is getting worse by the minute. Ooh. You think Moscow was better, eh? Better? I, I, I don't know what to say about that. We should worry. Whatever, possibly, what creature is out there lurking about. I don't see bodies though, or bones. Just abandoned. Everything is just abandoned. Unless you're telling me the the bodies are disintegrated. Then okay. Damn. Alright, okay. Turn right. There is nowhere else to go. Okay. <clears throat> what is what are those on the ground? Are those? Drive the courtyard on the left. Don't rush it. We're done for if we get stuck. <sighs> Don't worry. I am The weather still getting worse as well as the radiation. We can't stay here. That is noted. What's happening? Why isn't it going forward? Oh, okay, there you go. God damn it! Another car fire! Seems like a tank passed through here. Let's follow it. It's actually hard to see. I cannot hear you, sir. Let us run. All right, noted. Oh God, I I my move slow. Deep snow. 
I swear, if there are snow human animals, I am. <laughs> I'm gonna question everything. How in the world are they alive? Okay, finally I can move for a bit. Miller? Are you coming? Okay. Yeah? Yep. Oh god. Yep. Right. One way in, the question is the way out. Yeah, I would kill them if they. There is winter room animals. Okay. What about this thing? We open this thing. We pry it open. Through the carriage. I'll help you open that. Okay, there's the bodies now. They all suffocated. The question is there any survivors possibly? Get to the Lenin Square station. The institute is a stone throw from there. Uh -huh. The metro isn't very deep here. And with the radiation so high, the locals probably didn't last long. Yeah, that's what I was it's saying. Down here, we've already taken at least triple ooh, ooh, there. There's spiders. The yeah, if there's webs, so uh, well. Sure is. <sighs> Great. What do you know? The air is breathable. What? How did you know before taking off the freaking mask? This is way different than the metro. It's very square. Is it an usual mutant? That sounds different. That sounds a bit different. What are you talking about? The straightaway is blocked. Take a look around, Artyom. We need to get into the tunnel next to ours. We're taking left. We are taking left. We have no choice. We're taking left. <laughs> Uh -huh. Nah. Oh, it is an assault. You freaking mole. Wait, you look different. You look chunky. You old man. Holy heck. Yeah, they look. Do, uh, okay, enough of him admiring. Uh-huh. Yeah. Where? Okay, that's one. I thought you had that. Damn. These are probably related to the mutant. 
This should not be called Nosales, as there are moles. There, there are moles. Yeah, the question is how. What do they eat? I mean, they can eat each other, but. Holy heck, they're chunky! There's no freaking way! And I'm out of ammo for the shotgun, holy hell. I'll be saving it. You know what, the crossbow. I'm gonna test it out. Yeah, I, I, I am in need of it. Resources, what? Uh, you are cheeky. That is it. Alright. Yeah, the freaking game is so cheeky. It kind of used up my stuff. I had a load stock of whatever, but then they took it all. So good job on them. Okay, come on, old man, let's go. Talking way too loud, old man. The freaking things can hear us. You want me to test it for you? Did you hear that? Oh my god, the freaking tentacles in the ceiling. They look like freaking. What is that thing? Uvula. Oh, they're scared of the light? There's something in the water. We better get out. Please don't say that. Oh, okay. I hear it. I hear it, but. Yeah. Maybe you just better hurry up. What? Move. Here are the locals. Hmm. Reminds one of the execution pit in Moscow, doesn't it? Oh wow. Later, and we're at an execution pit again. I wonder if 
they would have called spies too. Ooh. It is such a cruel fate to be in place in the freaking sewers. The murderers. Okay. People died a year ago at most. There might still be survivors. Stay at the ready. Yeah, seems to be. They're not. Paid nap at work. <laughs> yeah, if only. Aren't your isn't your work done? There's a blue mushroom. Can I use the blue mushroom? I don't like these supports. The whole thing could collapse at any moment. Let's yeah. <laughs> Well, what's your plan? Let's go. I I don't trust this. <laughs> I don't trust this Miller. Miller, please don't leave me here. Miller. Come on, Miller. Let's uh, let's just go. Let's go. Oh whoa. Oh, that's useful. Damn. For the spiders. This was war after all. Oh. Okay. Now we see. Okay, they've been long dead and eaten. The, the, the what? Dushka. The defenders were protecting the station entrance. This one? There were quite a few survivors here. Until they killed each other off. Looks like that lie in Moscow did work after all. Hmm. Who's better, I wonder? Life built on a lie? Or death born of truth? Hmm. What? Uh, I feel. Oh, I don't feel happy about this. Oh, okay, easy way. This is a child ghost. Seeing things too. Uh, just, just walk. Radiation. We did catch quite a lot of it. No, 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 just walk. These are spirits. Oh, well, oops, sorry. Oh, wow. Uh. There's 
so many bodies. <gasps> I don't want it. Don't need me. Oh yeah! Oh my God! You're so freaking ugly. Yeah, I thought it was about to be freaking zombies. Then don't hurt their feelings. <laughs> uh -huh. I wonder if there are like dark ones here as well from the first two games. That would be like a good callback. As far as I understand, this is Sibirskaya, a line transfer station. Okay. Miller, we don't have enough bullets. We're both whole using our <laughs> weapons to the last bit. It's a wind that I'm hearing. It's entirely closed off. Damn! Oh, cut off again! <sighs> We're not opening that gate for sure. Well, I have to go back to the service tunnels. Alright. Oh, do that there. Those people here did survive for some time. We never had any communication with Novo Sibirsk, but assumed they had jammers too. Mm -hmm. After the bombs fell, the defense committee decided that hiding was our only chance to prevent new attacks. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. Yes, we lied to the people of Moscow. But how else were we supposed to band them together, protect them? Dead men can't enjoy freedom. Look around here, Artyom. You might find something useful. Yeah, man, this kind of reminds me of the first time we fought together in the first game. Hmm. Hold on. I need as much of these because I'm out of the things.
They will. Should get into the ventilation tunnel, and from there to the next track tunnel. All right. The only good thing about this is that we're not using our piece of iron. our vents. What? <gasps> oh my god, you scared me. It's a kid. Okay. Follow him, good luck. Alright, what about you? Never mind, I'm chasing, I'm chasing. Oh my god. Kid, come here. Damn my adult body! Na 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 na! Come back here. What the? Hello? Okay. <laughs> yeah, this is home alone mode. Wait, what? Okay. Hiya. Okay. Come on, boy! Enough hiding! Nothing to be afraid of! <laughs> Miller, you're scaring him. There's nothing to fear. We just want to talk. Oh. What can I do here? Well, I have a feeling that you might be in this. Ugh. Poison water. Okay, there's nothing for me, but... Am I supposed to look for something here? Come out, boy! Enough hiding! Nothing to be afraid of! There is a kid! Grab him, Artyom! Stop! Where do you think you're going? Finally! Why did you run? Come on, speak up, soldier! Identify yourself! Trivia. I'm from Moscow. Aren't you with them? Them? Yeah, I don't know who you mean by that. But if they kill children, we're definitely against them. So you can take us to your commander. Mm. Why do you want to see him? We're on an important mission. 
Details of which may only be disclosed to ranking officers. You just have to take us to them. Besides, you don't really have much choice. All right. No monkey business, mind you. All right. I can't believe there's still survivors here. Oh my god. to the institute but there's no more green stuff left there green stuff and what's that you don't know wait which station are you from our team is from the exhibition and i'm from polis huh where is that very far it's from here Moscow, soldier. Okay, we're defending you, kid. Miller. What in the world are you throwing there? Checker left. Checker left. Look at them run! Just like old times! Sure. Like a carnival. You can come out now. Hey, where did you go? Is he gone? How are we supposed to find him now? Oh, don't blame the kid. Oh my god, <laughs> this is a blind way. Are you really from Moscow? We are. I'm Colonel Miller, leader of a special task force. Artyom here is one of my subordinates. We came from Moscow on a train. Wow, this is cool. Wait a second, I'll open the gate. There's no guards. And the kids are operating on their own. I will assume there's more kids. These are for the moles, okay. I thought you were right. We had a war here, you see. We noticed that. He's a blue duck thief. <laughs> Well, I don't think the rioters can go through with that much moles. Whoa. A cozy place you got here. Where is everyone? Dead's on a mission, and there's nobody else. Not since the war, anyways. 
<laughs> it just saw the something. The was tough enough to live through the nuclear war, but not the civil one. How long has it been just the two of you? Uh, almost a year. We are lucky. Have a whole lot of ninjas, like the rich guys. Wait, Orpheum, a satellite map. This is the valley where Alyosha and you got lost. Hmm. Where did you get this from? High radiation levels are emitted to suspicious Volga. When did he leave? A month back. He has been off the air for the last three weeks. I see. That's funny. Mm. Do you know where he went? What was the mission? Oh, are they the ones that I heard from the radio? We were going to leave the city in the spring. You want to go get the impact map? Said we're sure to find a clear place if we get one. Got it. Right. We need to use your radio. Artyom, let's contact the Aurora. I'm going to get that map. We should tell them. Lake Baikal. I've I've heard of Lake Baikal actually. You read me, Aurora. Miller here. Let it was stuck. I'm going there for the map. Artyom takes the institute. Copy that, Colonel. How is Anna doing? She's asleep. Try to make haste there. Katya says Anna's going to have another attack soon, and she's way too sleepy. Come again, Aurora. Over. Do you copy, Aurora? Over. again. Artyom, if his father has really found a clean place, this is a chance for Anna, for the boys, for all of us. A chance to have a real life. Mm -hmm. I'll go get that map. Meet me here once you recover the medicine. Then we'll uh. go get the car. Go outside with our anti -rad. We still have three left. Dad was saving them for our escape from the city. Great. Thank you. Artyom, get geared up in the meantime. You're sending me out there alone. There's even a workbench here. Uh-huh. By the way, you can take my rail gun if you want. It might be of more use where you're going. I'm actually curious what your rail gun uses. Tell me when you're ready. Well fine. Wait, I'm just curious, I'm just curious, I'm just curious. Is this the real gun? Oh, this is the Tikar. But I'm, I'm just curious, wait. Oh, so that's why it uses that thing, okay. No, the crossbow is still okay for me. As far as I understand, that ventilation is our exit to the station. Yes, that one! Then you go through the station, then take the right tunnel. This thing is simple. Just take a shot if you feel sick. 7-7. Seven, seven. Thank then. you. So, this is what had been keeping them all alive. Yep. Oh my god, my stuff needs cleaning. <laughs> Especially by crossbow. Holy heck, what happened to that thing? I am so low on resources again. Hello, it's not. The first time. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm here. What is this? Are you ready? 
Yeah. Good luck. Remember why we are in this. The life of my daughter, your wife, is in your hands now. Now go. Going alone. I already know that. God, the mutants. I hate everything about this. Two bullets and that. Okay, we might use my crossbow for a bit. So the mutants broke through, settlement broke through. Hmm. Okay. Do I have a map? Do Are you telling me this is what I'm gonna be going through? <laughs> okay, this is on top of the city though. Or is these the train stations? We're back in an element metro, we have to get to Lenin Square station. Hmm, alright. Not that useful of a map, but okay. What happened to the flashlight of my map? Oh, never mind, it's there. Alright, uh. Crap. Let me double check stuff. There's. Anything here? Yep. Okay. I'm going to be a horde goblin in this state. Below or above? Check down here. I mean, there's something above me, but what the hell? Okay. I have no choice but above. It's a. What in the world is this? Floating tiny cup. More surprised they're more dried up instead of eaten. Twelve o'clock, one o'clock. One o'clock is over here too. Where? Where is it? Two? A 
That's one. Things are far freaking uglier than the ones in Moscow. Can I not take them out? I want to take out this one that is closest here. That's one. That's two. I assume the other one is up here. Yeah, it's up here. Where? Is it down there? It's four. Okay, my only choice is to get down from here. Down the stairs, noted. <laughs> back anything up here <sighs> let me check this place first I need to get as much resources that I could. This is this side. Oh well. I know I have NVG, but Try 
Put it down now, rather than later. Okay, let me check up up here instead. That might be just a trap in front. I don't think I have anything there. Some things are not worth going through. Mushroom that's above, but okay, let me check. What about down here? I remembered. <gasps> what do you mean you're dead? You're dead. Stop it. <laughs> Come on. Freaking. Seriously. Because if the way is not up he down here, it tells me that it's up there. Hmm? Okay, it's up there. Noted. Okay, I'm going to be in full night vision right now because yeah is it them that i was detecting earlier okay i'll assume it's them okay this I'm going to be crawling all the way through this place. I don't care. 
Is this a map? Yeah. I don't know why I'm whispering, but you know. It's better than not. Okay. So it is upstairs. What? What do you want? Ugh, sheesh. Though using the freaking night vision consumes a lot of battery, which is a problem. Okay, I don't hear a BB. Ooh. Ooh. Ain't no way I'm getting into that hole. Ugh. Okay. Emma, 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 thank you. Weak wood, hurt. I don't Before I proceed any further, let me just prepare myself. Just to be sure. Okay, I'm battle ready. Perfect. I have no choice but to go down, maybe. Okay, I have no choice, huh? Can I walk the railings? Can I walk the railings? <coughs> Never mind. No, I cannot walk the railings. I walk lower floor. That thing fell true. That thing fell true. That <laughs> that thing keeps on falling true. Okay. 
enemy harder. You know what? Fuck you. Fuck you! Freaking rats! No way I would have gotten through this without a fight. I mean, I was able to pick them off one by one. Hold on. Which is good. But oh my god. that thing. I'm gonna assume that the fight is over. Just gonna assume. I need all of this mushrooms because it's for me to make healing. Before I proceed on forward to the next location, I'll we'll need to do this. That one. Consumes a lot of battery. Where am I at the moment? <laughs> I'm not even going anywhere near my target. What do you mean? Hey, okay. let's see if we. Resources? Resources? Other than mushrooms? Better if it's bullets, which would be awesome. It's 
a boat. It's a tugboat. Okay, let's go. This is the worst part. Oh, is that a shrimp or another catfish? But I know there's just something in the water. I have to adjust to my new enemies again. Yeah. Supposed to head. Mm -mm. <laughs> I should have changed into the decor. What the f Oh Why? Ew, why? Why? Yeah. <laughs> I don't care if they see me, they see me. Oh no. They're going to be a headache. Holy hell. Ow. What? What? Did that thing die? I hate everything. 
Every stream gives me a heart attack. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, freaking. Oh my god. Everything is just so sudden. Freak you, sir. Freak you, I don't care. I hate you, I hate you, I hate everything about you. <laughs> God, these disgusting worms. Wait, what? What did I do here? Did I just... I just circled around. This one. What? Yeah, I should have changed my gun. Holy hell. These are strong. This is strong. And I can recover my ammo back. But... Kidding me? Yeah, I should have changed my gun. This was just a random stop. This was just a random stop. Okay, then. All right. Let's get back into it. It's so hard to steer the boat. Go on the left side. There you go. My freaking goodness, look at the freaking pentacles on the ceiling again. It's so fleshy. Uh, why? Good thing you're scared of the light. This is a different type of pentacles. looks more like it just looks uh oh no 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 uh come on freaking slugs oh my god there's always so many steps don't you freaking dare <laughs> I'm not wasting my bullets here. Let's go. Oh, <coughs> oh my god. <laughs> I hate everything about this. 
And those sound that they make. It's getting lower and lower. <gasps> I can't tell if that's a worm or a sensitive says centipede. So fleshy, so fleshy. Okay, we're where is it? Slugs. Get off my goddamn face! <laughs> Out of my face. Oh god. What do I do? I can't drive. Okay, hold on. No, 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 no. It's not letting me drive. Oh, God. <laughs> I hate worms. I hate everything about this. Uh, spiders, worms, and... <sighs> Thank you. I hate everything about you. Please get me off. Please. G giant catfish? No, that one is just. That one is fine. Freaking worms? Okay, moles and worms. Oh my god. How do I kill these things? If I cannot kill it, I outgrow. <gasps> I cannot kill these things. Get off my face. Oh my. Where the fuck am I? <sighs> okay. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. I need. Yeah, sure. It's all that. Actually, you know what? This. It's okay. Where's the moles at? This is their food. I have to run to that one. Everything is so flashy. Oh my god. Okay, I got up here. I have to run towards that way. <laughs> oh my god, there are babies! Come on. Freaking disgusting.
am slipping, sliding. Sliding around. What? What hit me? Oh, there it is. Where am I going? Okay, up there. <gasps> holy, 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 This is for you, my love. <laughs> forward my mask my helmet isn't doing well Okay, this one. <laughs> Don't mind my aggressive saving, but yeah. Okay, I go down. I go down. But where do I go next? I'm bringing down the boat. Noted. I go down and I bring down the boat. Where is it? Where is it? Come on, where's the control? No. Great. I knew it. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> All right. I'm gonna reload just to be sure. These freaking things are aware of me. Even. Okay, thank you. Ah. Oh my god, my weapon needs cleaning. Oh my goodness, there we go. Oh wait. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. I can can I change my guns? Because I cannot do this if the Nasalizes are... Ah, I cannot. Okay, for now. Uh, prepare with it. It's fine. How many medals do I have? Because likely healing is what I need more. It's okay. Okay. Safe here. Now, where am I? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm still so far away. Alright. You're telling me to crawl here. Right. Fine. <laughs> and that thing is right at my face. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, dingle dangle. Ugh. Everything's so fleshy. I'm slipping sliding. Ah, so slimy. Where's the boat? 
So my goal is to boat all the way there. Come on. Oh! You guys are gonna leave me alone now? Don't have the light on this thing, but okay, let's go. Faster, faster, faster! Just skip down, just skip down. No, 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 you know what? I'm gonna blow you guys up. I do not care. Into the hole. Get into the hole. Just... I'm just moving myself into the hole. <laughs> you bastard! No! No! Please. No. Oh, this is not letting me. Oh god. <gasps> again, again, nice. Yes. Easing my way. Okay. Easing my way. Don't mind me, please. Leave me the hell alone. Why is everything so fleshy? I mean, this is better than having freaking moles in my way. <gasps> is it? It's not. Uh oh. Uh oh. The Geiger counter. Oh no. I don't have a light. I am not hearing anything. I'm just gonna pretend I don't hear anything. Uh oh. Uh oh. That am I? Radiation too strong. Ow.
better. What is... Huh? Whoa. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, it's the thing that they call anomalies. Am I not allowed through here? Is this going to lead me to outside? Finally? <laughs> Please don't do this to me. to kill the light. Freaking ghosts! <laughs> Get me out! Oh! What the? <laughs> What's going on? What the? Um, this is normal. I, I, 
Um, I guess. Please. Are they trying to suffocate me? Wait, I just changed my filter. Blind one? What? What's the blind one? Okay, I have new enemies. Enemies that I cannot see. Why would they do that? What in the world are these big f f feet? What are these? Is this a big foot? Or are these the Nasalises? I actually don't know what I'm against right now. But it's draining my energy fast. This is...
Okay. Where in the world am I? <gasps> I am here. Okay, what happened? What did I do? Am I here? Miller, please. Please be with me. I'm so alone. It's... Oh, God. Don't mind me, I'm actually just topping up, making sure that I am fully topped up with everything. Rather than just leaving it be like that. I go there or I go here? Can't go here. That's it. Okay, the game is dropping frames. Okay, over here. What is... Artem, what is happening to you? It's so hard to see anything. Didn't I just pass through here? Things are flooding. Am I fighting with ghosts? Every bit of this is actually scaring me. Okay, can I go through there? Scaring me in a way that it's... It's making me uncomfort uncomfortable. Look 
think this anomaly is actually following me around. <laughs> Still here. I hear coughing. It's the voices of the dead. The fact that this is a hospital. Okay. They? I feel like my character is circling around. I'm so sorry. Is this gonna turn on? Oh. Partial recovery in what? Okay. The question is can you even find a medicine? Wow, how far am I going? Uh, this is what? <laughs> what in the world is that? What? 
I didn't shoot. That thing is affecting me. No, I don't hear you. To the blind one. Is that the voice of the thing? I am. Hi, Maggie. So sorry about that. <laughs> This is like the freaking librarians. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, stop using my wife's voice. Yeah, yes I am. I'm trying. I'm trying. Maybe we just burn all of this so I don't know. What do you mean by that? Just come, come back, back please. Just come back. Is my wife turning into an anomaly? <laughs> Can't save right now. Okay. Let me save. And then I do this. Okay, what's the next thing to do? Find one here during a thousand miles. Uh huh.
is it? Where do I go? Out here? No, it's not. Where am I going? Up here, up here, up here. Can I close that thing? No? No, okay. Not that. Oh, it's outside that building. It's not alone. It's not alone! <laughs> I've never seen it aggressively in this fucking game. I guess I don't want to repeat the same area over and over. Uh oh. What is happening? a lot of glass really Oh my god, this is like the freaking librarian, I swear. <laughs> like, full ass sneak. That one is easier, this one is more terrifying that... than those. Where is it gonna come from? Where is it gonna come from? Miller, if I die, this is on you. Arjun, please stop doing that. This is not her.
I'm gonna save. Oh, I might need saving. Thank you. No, you don't smell food. Stop it. I don't care. <laughs> I'm not. That is just scary. Oh god, I'm so sorry guys. Oh my god, uh, flashing lights. Do I go? Cut. <laughs> no, 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 you're 
I don't know where I am. You don't see me. You don't see me. Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> oh my god. Arjun, please. I wanna get out of this place. Please. Look at this jungle snow. For the fun. I'm so tense at the moment. Oh my god. Okay. I didn't. A little breather. <laughs> That's a hole. And if there's a hole, yeah. Could have gotten more than that. How long was I out? <sighs> Miller. Son, in just a minute, you'll get better now. You found. 
wrong that you did. <laughs> Don't you dare die on me now. Don't even think about it. Not what I tell you then, huh? Soldier, no sleeping now. I did find you after all. <laughs> Don't know how. <laughs> Stay with me, Artyom. You're alive! Alive! I thought I was all alone again. Get up! Quick! He's asleep. Better leave them be when they get like this. It's just a straight drive from now on. He tried to teach me to drive, but... He just... went out like this. Miller? Miller? His eyes are open, kid. It's the, are you sure he's just sleeping? Hooray! We're moving again! You are... I assume that you're going to be my adopted son. The question is, where's your dad, kid? On the way back, we got jumped like mutants. But then he shot them all. Bam! Right with me in the eye. Oh, okay. Freaking. What in the world was that spike? Bam. Hold on, kid. We'll get there. It's actually hard to see. We'll get rid of I'm trying, kid.
Focus, Katya! What do we do? Tell us! <coughs> An emergency transfusion. We must give him as much blood as we can. Transfusion it is then. Will it save him? It will keep him alive for a little longer. As long as there is blood. What's his blood type? Hey, be positive. We could give him any type. Get everyone here. Don't go to sleep, Artyom. <coughs> no, you can't go to sleep. <coughs> Staying underground grew old. That's it, Stepan. You can't give more. Look! He's up! Can you hear me, Artyom? Don't you dare die on us. Just don't you dare. You've got a whole life ahead of you. And kids! So fight for it. Fight! Why did you stop? Didn't you always want to go outside? Didn't you open that airlock at the botanical garden? This place is much better. This isn't your destination, Artyom. You're not there yet, not even close. It's not your station, it's just a dead end. Not your goal. Can you hear me? Give me your hand. Oh, you're burning up. Well, I, I hope this old man's blood will do something about that, that hot head of yours, eh? <laughs> Come on, let's go. Okay, my friend. Time to get some quality blood in that body of yours, eh? This, ah, you'll be up in no time. Or I'll eat my own shoes, huh? <laughs> you know, I finally feel like I belong somewhere. I am no longer an outsider. You keep us together, Artyom. You must survive for all of our sakes. Let's go to this summit. You've got a wife you need to work on making kids with. And my fiance is still in Moscow. We still have to stir some shit up back in the metro, so don't you fucking dare die here. Look, Artyom. Lake Baikal ah, makes you believe real life is possible. Not the petty rat race we had back in the metro. I just... Just have to say, you were right, Artyom. Right for wanting to get us out, bring us here. And I, <laughs> the old fool, I was simply afraid. Afraid of life, as I see now. <gasps> Look, he's smiling. Smiling in his sleep. He even seems to say something. It's his fever talking. He's burning up. This world is worth giving everything up for, Artyom. <laughs> you were always ready. And I uh, was too attached to my position in the rat race. I'm sorry. Sorry for what happened to Anna. Sorry for blaming you. <sighs> Had I not pumped everyone up about the occupying forces, she'd never have fallen there. I feel... I beg you, don't die. Stay with me, please. I don't want a life if you're not a part of it. Can you hear me? Look at me, Artyom. Look at me, please. Yes, about Anna. You will have to look out for her. 
Now that I can't anymore. I don't care if you go to that ocean. Just stay with her. <coughs> I'm keeping her out. She can barely stand herself, but she's ready to give all her blood to him. At least the medicine helped. It's a miracle. I have a daughter, but I also wanted a son. A really stubborn one, just like me. Like you. I really like this place. It's so clean. I'd like to stay here forever. Could you arrange that for me? <laughs> and the most important thing, my time's up, Artyom. It's your turn now. Step up. Leave them. Just remember that I created the order to save people. All people, Artyom. Don't forget that. Because I somehow did. Goodbye, Commander. Time to wake up. Come on. Rise and shine, son. The fever is subsiding. I think he's getting better. Now he needs some rest. You too, Anna. We've got hope now. We found the place I saw in my dream. That hill on the shores of Baikal where Miller took me. A clean place, just like he said. Everything around is clean. We found ourselves a home. A home at the foot of a hill, overlooking a lake. A home where we could raise our children, who will be born not in the damp and dark tunnels, but under blue sky and bright sun. Ladies and gentlemen, as the ranking officer, I propose a motion to entrust the duty of commanding the order to our job. Unanimously approved. So, what would your orders be, sir? I would say we all go home. But this home seems too large for just us. You know, the colonel once told me, he created the order to save people, all of them. I say it's time we perform this duty. That is so sad in the end. What the heck?
I really don't regret playing this game at all. My god, it's such a roller coaster and the freaking enemy at the very end. Okay, hell. Oh, hi. Lion of the Desert. Hello, welcome, welcome. Barely got halfway through before hitting a bug. Can't progress now. Oh, that's so bad. What kind of bug did you encounter? It's okay, a shame. I mean, yeah, I, I can see why you say bug. I mean, I have encountered. I, I guess the main problem on my end is that it's actually <laughs> it's breaking FPS very very hard as well so but despite it being an old game it's so underrated it, it, the adaptation for the book is so good yeah I, I really don't regret that props to the props to the team that made the game but from what I understand they're making a year version of the game? I don't know. <laughs> you just imagine playing it in VR. <laughs> my god. My guide got stuck at the bars before the mine. <laughs> Annoying because it's so good. Oh no. <laughs> it's so bad. Have you tried restarting it? Or re refreshing the thing? Or re downloading the game, maybe possibly? It's so bad. The game is so good. Uh, I don't care what others may say about it or like if they compare it how it is on the first two games on the trilogy. But this last game makes sense because they're like, they're out. So I like how they take off the concept. It's almost linear despite it being a little bit of open world-ish. But holy hell. I hope that you're, you, you'd be able to play it. And man, <laughs> freaking freaking yeah, again, like I said, towards the end, it's such a roller coaster of emotion that it just slaps you hard with the <laughs> like you shall cry now. <laughs> oh my god. Yep. Yeah. Because I, I have seen this game for a long while and I was able to now pick up on it. So yeah, so that's the that's the main campaign. The main story. Really, really worth it. Despite it being like uh, lagging here, hard here and there, and there may be a bit of bugs here and there as well. Like uh, I'm trying to shoot the enemies. It's not. <laughs> it's not registering. But oh well. It happens. Oh, thank you for the follow, Lion. Lion of the Desert. I, uh, can I just call you Lion? Or Leon, maybe? It's... I don't see many games that actually kind of adopt to books much. I mean, or shows. Because sometimes, like, it, it, take for an example of a comic, and then you, someone, uh, a product, a team takes on to like adapt it into a show, and then you'd end up kind of disappointed sometimes because they sometimes take out the good bits or how they executed the thing is quite fast, or you know, they remove the good bits. <laughs> This one, I can at least say that, yeah, they kind of did it at least some justice. Uh, 
Um, also... Yeah. Alright. But yes, again, thank you. Thank you for the follow. And how did you find me? <laughs> did you just randomly find me because of this game? But yeah, uh, for those that are new, uh, yeah, hi. I'm Hex Jolini. I hope you guys enjoy your stay here. Um, I do play a variety of games, but mostly I take on story-heavy games because I enjoy the immersion of it. So yeah. And sometimes I would do art, but I haven't done art in a while, so... Maybe sometime soon. <laughs> Alright. So that's the game. And I will be taking on the... DLCs. Because the game actually has, I, I think, two DLCs. One is the, the story of the two generals, I think. And then some character. Their story, so... I don't know exactly how long the those DLCs will be, so I will be doing those on the next time that I stream. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. So uh, right now I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let this thing run its credits. I guess the one thing that I'm kind of sad is um, it didn't really explain much on about the dark ones on the first game. Like what happened to them then? I mean, on the, yeah, like, maybe I'm kind of like spoiling it, but sure, the, it continued off on to the second game, but the very end of the second game, it, it just ended there. And I kind of was looking forward, like, oh, maybe they met again or, you know, found a simil similar type of those things, those creatures from the first two games, but uh, oh well. Still. I was searching for someone called Hexio that killed me in Apex. <laughs> it's all Metrix, it is so clicked. Uh, <laughs> oh, woo. Were you playing some kind of rank ish thing in Apex? I have tried playing Apex way, way before. But uh, nowadays, I, I don't exactly play it. So yeah. But if you're going to wonder, no, I'm not that person. <laughs> the last time that I played that game is way back... Um, three years ago? Three years? Two years ago? Yeah. Were they like a cheater? Did they kind of shoot you through... <laughs> <laughs> through a wall? Or were they kind of talking very very bad? Or maybe they were they were a good uh they were a good enemy to you. That's so uh, hey. Welcome still. So. Oh, I didn't realize Dolby is... Oh, okay, no wonder maybe for the surround sound part of it. I actually was surprised on the surround system of the game.
I was starting to remember about this. Was this Lake Baikal? I think I've kind of seen it on the internet, of course. And from what I understand, it's like one of the places that is pretty famous. So it's a quite quite a good nod to that. Nice. Let's go. We have traveled. 10,000 miles kilometers or something so we have traveled very very far in the game so yeah there you go and yeah I, I actually have the two DLCs so I'll be checking those out on the next time the next stream that I'll be doing <laughs> yes again very very definitely very very worth playing this game <laughs> and for that I'm gonna have to say that's enough for me because it's very very late and I need to rest